The Big Belt by Shatar Safira Collier. From the Big Series, Fairy Tales for Everyone. Story number one. Once upon a time, there was a boy named Norman G. Finley. He spoke so quietly. Whenever he spoke, sound barely came out. In fact, he had one of the tiniest speaking voices in his whole town. Even though his voice was small, every day and sometimes many times a day, he would let out the big belch. He didn't do it on purpose. All of a sudden, it would just happen. The big belch would surprise everyone around him. It would surprise him too. It made a huge wind, a gigantic sound, and the smell was awful. Every morning, he would have a yummy, healthy breakfast. Then, right after breakfast, the big belch would appear. On the school bus, when the big belch appeared, it would rattle the whole bus. At the playground, when the big belch appeared, it cleared the whole park. His best friend Connor often told him, It's okay, Norman. Still, no one seemed to know what to do about the big belch or how to make it go away. One day, Norman's mom, Gloria, decided to throw him a huge birthday party. All of his friends were invited. They were going to swim in the pool. They were going to have a pinata. His dad, George, even had a moon bounce delivered to the house so everyone could jump and play. 